today I'm going to be filming my Christmas haul, birthday haul, and then just a few things I've gotten lately. I know this video is really late, but it's my favorite video to watch, so I thought I'd film it for you guys. Disclaimer, I am extremely thankful for everything I got, and I it was not necessary for people to give me things, but it's just a thoughtful gesture during the season. And I do know the real meaning of Christmas, so without further ado, let's get started. The first things I'm going to show you is what I have gotten lately. So I was at the store the other day with my mom, and she let me pick up this Maybelline's Blush to Nudes palette for the spring, and I think this will be fun to play around with. We also got Daddy Daycare and Daddy Day Camp on DVD. It was in the 374 bin at Walmart, and we love Daddy Daycare, but had never seen Daddy Day Camp. So I'm excited to watch that and see how good that movie is. Then my mom picked up these tops for herself, actually. They're little workout tops, but she ended up not liking them. So she gave them to me, and we have a blue one and a purple one. And then I use these types of pens for my planner, and when I saw all these colors at Sam's Club, I freaked out and my mom let me get them because there's lots of colors I don't have and so that'll be fun to use in my planner. Now on to my birthday stuff. For my birthday, my grandma on my mom's side got me this Olaf onesie. Super cute. It has Olaf on it and I love wearing these. I think they're so warm. Then my grandma on my dad's side got me this Grace movie because I have all the other American Girl doll movies. Annie, The Best of Me, and Despicable Me Too. And then she also got me this Starbucks ornament, which I love. I love, love, love it. Now on to other gifts for Christmas. For Christmas, one of my great aunts got me this blanket, and it matches my pillows on my bed, and I just really like it. And then at work, we had Secret Santa. And my secret Santa got me this blanket and this lotion. And then we also did white elephant gift exchanges. And I got a $10 Starbucks gift card, peanut M&M's, Sour Patch Kids, and a chocolate Christmas tree. And next, I'll go to what my grandma on my mom's side got me for Christmas, and she got me Pitch Perfect 2. I love the first one, and I haven't finished watching this one yet, but this one's really awesome as far as I've got so far. And then my aunt on my mom's side got me this Vera Bradley lunchbox. I had a couple lunchboxes, but they were all too big, I thought, for school. And so she got me this one, and it's the perfect size. I can't wait to use it next week. Then from another great aunt of mine for Christmas, she got me... The North Pole Christmas Movie, I love Hallmark Christmas Movies, The A Princess for Christmas Christmas Movie, Amy Claus is Coming to Town, Santa Baby 2, and Hairspray. And then from one of my aunts, my aunt on my dad's side, I got this cute flannel romper pajamas which I can't wait to wear that this summer. I think it'll be really cute to wear this summer when we go to Tennessee. And then these scalloped pajama bottoms that are just plaid. And then lots of candy, lots of Kit Kats and M&Ms, a hand sanitizer, and my cousins made me these little Olaf color rainbow moon things. And then for my boss, she got us all pink jackets with our work logo on them for Christmas. She also got us t-shirts we could wear to work with our work logo on them. Then she got me these two Jamberries, a Christmas one and a New Year's one, because I really like those. She also got me a Army Green Pico Top and a Blush Pink Pico Top. Some Body Mist, a $100 Meat Bill Chocolate Bar. Next, in my stocking for my papa and my grandma, they always put stuff from other countries in there. They go visit other countries every year. And last year they went to Canada and they went to Greece. And I just got stuff from there in my stocking. Then next, I've been needing a robe and they got me this navy robe for Christmas. It matches my bathroom colors. 
They also got me this homemade Christmas book, which I'm really excited to do some of these for next year. It's just a really cool little book, and I think this will be fun to do DIYs with next year. Then I also got from them this patterned hat and a scarf, which will be fun to use whenever it actually snows outside. It hasn't done that yet this year. And then I got some moisturizing gloves, a white flowy tank top from American Eagle, and a pink one, just the same one in a different color, these maroon shorts, this little um, hand sanitizer holder from Bath & Body Works, and these tab divider folders for my cookbook because the little sprinkles make really cute for a cookbook. And they also got me this mixing bowl set, which I'm really excited about because I've started wanting to get some stuff like for household things for whenever I move out. So that was awesome. Then next I'll go with stocking stuffers from Santa, what Santa got me. So Santa got me this Tervis cup with a mason jar on it and a bow tie. I love mason jars, I love bow ties, I love anything southern, and so this was a great stocking stuffer. I got peppermint dipped pretzels, which as you can see I've already started eating. I got some washi tape, three different ones. I got some Buncha Crunch, which I like to put in my popcorn. Some dark chocolate hot chocolate. Three candy canes. A new planner cover for my planner, and it has my name at the bottom. And then three sticker books for my planner. And then also these mason jar measuring spoons, which I really like. Then next to the stuff my parents got me for Christmas, they got me this black vest, which I'd like to wear with a long sleeve t-shirt. Just a really sporty, casual look. Then I got this Elsa top from Lily Pulitzer. I think it's adorable. It's so cute. And I can't wait to wear it when it gets a little warmer outside. And then I also got a pink vest for Christmas from them. I got some new Nike Tempo Run shorts. They're my favorite kind of shorts, so I was really excited to get those for Christmas. And I also got them in this color. This pink color. And then I got a popcorn holder for my popcorn when I like watch movies because I love to watch movies. It's one of my favorite things to do. I got this cute little mason jar. It's a little cup holder. I think it'll be cute to someday write for Santa on it or something with this plate I got. I got cookies for Santa plate for my future home. I got a life is better with a dog sign. It matches my room and I'm excited to put it up in my room. I got these pink socks for Christmas. They're my favorite kind of socks to wear. I really like the ones with the pink toes that are hands. They're super soft and comfy. Then I got some Lily Pulitzer shorts. I got these ones with the scallops on the bottom. I think they're called the buttercup shorts. Then I also got this pair. Then I got a squirt. I have not had a squirt since I was a little girl, but I was really excited to receive this one and the seersucker print was awesome. I also got this pair of shorts and it's really cute because it has a little zipper on the back. Then I was super excited. Our family celebrates 4th of July really big every year and we always go to my mom's family and I got this cute 4th of July romper to wear next year to 4th of July and I just love it. Then probably my favorite thing I received this year for Christmas was my first Lily popover. And it's in the Scuba to Cuba print, which is my favorite print, and I think it's going to be so cute to wear. Then last, I'll show you all the DVDs I received. Like I said, I love watching movies, so I did receive a lot of DVDs for Christmas. The first one is The Great Gatsby. What to Expect When You're Expecting. Bride Wars. Dear John. The Last Song. 
Safe Haven, which was the last one I needed to complete my Nicholas Sparks collection, and also The Blind Side, which is my all-time favorite movie. And that's everything I got for Christmas. I hope you guys liked that, and it was also a little, you know, mixed haul with my birthday since it's not too far before Christmas. And then also a little haul I got after Christmas from my mom. And I just thank you guys for watching the video, and I'm sorry that it's up so late. I've just been super busy with family in town, and sorry if I keep looking at the viewfinder because I'm still not used to looking at the camera quite yet with being newer to YouTube. But I just thank you guys for watching, and hopefully I'll get videos up on Friday. That's always been my goal, but I've been a little off every time, but I have got a video up every week. So thanks for watching. Bye!